I lost everything that was in my refrigerator inside. We lost everything that was in my deep freeze outside. I still got trees in my yard. I got damage to where I live, and I'm disabled. I can't get out there and move the trees. Some people did have to leave their pets behind if they had to evacuate quickly. The recovery process only just beginning for families in our area. These homes in Volano Beach remain roped off and condemned. After Hurricane Irma crippled our community, Feeding Northeast Florida responded. People need food all the time in our community. But when tragedy strikes like this, it is, it is especially so. We always say that the food bank is the community food bank. And there has been no better time to actually see that. From volunteers, to donors, to people who are, are contributing food. Neighbors helping neighbors. So I'm here organizing food and uh, sorting through things that makes it easier to pass out to families. Uh, everybody was affected by Hurricane Irma, so any a little bit of amount of time that I can give, I'm gonna give it up. There's a lot of people who are without homes, without food and, and water. There's a lot of people giving their time, uh, first responders, volunteers. So what I'm asking of everyone is please, if you can, donate to the Feeding Northeast Florida. Strangers helping strangers. We started collecting donations, you know, paper towels, toilet paper, uh, cleaning supplies, water, non-perishable food. We're just trying to help out with the relief efforts for the hurricane victims. Uh, something that I uh, just kind of felt like uh, needed to do. People helping people. Thank you so much for your help. You're yeah, you're helping a lot of people, huh? Our community came together. Our mission at Feeding Northeast Florida more critical than ever. These people have gone for several days without food because the utilities just got on, so their food at home is spoiled. And if you like salads, these have a fork with them if you want one of these. Yes, please. Awesome. Veterans. Mothers, seniors, families turning to us when there's no place left to turn. I'm just happy, you know, just glad that somebody's out here trying to give us a chance and, you know, I think it's just God coming in and don't really know the right words to say, but just thank God for you guys just looking out for us. Sometimes you can only afford with your money can, you know, allow you. So uh, I thank y'all you did a lot of good because there's a lot of good fresh vegetables Got a lot of good nutrition and stuff, and I want to thank you from the bottom of my heart. In just one week post-storm, Feeding Northeast Florida provided more than 250,000 meals across our eight-county service area. We stand committed with our 160 partner hunger relief organizations through the storm and after. It's an honor to, to help right now, and so whatever we can do, we're going to do it. We are here feeding a stronger tomorrow, together. You know, I have to eat. And so, however long, I'm, I'm just grateful.